Welcome back. Time for the news in full. The 33rd Armed Forces Culture Symposium was held on Tuesday dedicated to Mark Martyr Day. President Sisi honored the families of martyrs and the wounded in military operations during the event. Prime Minister Medbouli, Defense Minister General Mohammed Zaki and a number of ministers and senior officials attended the event. The symposium was held under the title, If not for them, we wouldn't be here. Addressing the symposium, President Sisi said Egypt does not forget its martyrs. He said the legends of the martyrs who sacrificed their lives for the nation urge Egyptians to preserve their country. As Sisi said, all respect and appreciation go for Egypt's martyrs, adding that protecting nations is not an easy task, but a task that requires sacrifices. As Sisi added that if not for the sacrifices of the martyrs, security and stability would not be attained. He said Egypt will witness the birth of a new state and a new republic with the inauguration of the, of the new administrative capital. As Sisi said, the region has witnessed developments that destroy the concept of the national state. He said uh, that he hails the role of the armed forces, police forces, in countering the forces of destruction. As for the coronavirus pandemic, as Sisi said, the medical team's task during the crisis is also highly appreciated. He said the state seeks to make citizens' lives better through the Decent Life Initiative. President Sisi uh, said encroachment on agricultural lands must be stopped, as well as the acceleration of illegal constructions. <coughs> Prime Minister Medbouli held talks on Tuesday with the Minister of Environment, Dr. Yasmin Fouad. He was briefed on developments and revenues from natural reserves and investment projects planned for them. The reserves discussed included those of the central zone, southern Sinai, the Red Sea and Aswan. For her part, Dr. Fouad said the ministry is now laying down a plan for the disposal of construction waste over short and long term schemes. She said the cooperation protocol is to be signed with a German company for the establishment of an industrial production unit for compressed wood from palm leaves. The scheme aims to decrease the amount of imported compressed wood in Egypt. The Health Ministry reported new 591 coronavirus cases and 43 deaths. In its daily report, the ministry said recoveries have reached 144,000 cases from a total of 187,000. The ministry said it is still on high alert and follows up on coronavirus developments around the clock. The statement said precautionary measures are taken to uh, fend against any viruses or contagious diseases. Russia's Sputnik 5 vaccine against COVID-19 could be produced in Europe for the first time.